Okay, so here's a quick training on how to do some organic marketing for your YouTube channel. So if you are not getting a lot of views, you might want to think about um, getting more people from Facebook and from other areas that might be interested in your video. So let's take for example, I did a video for one of my clients called, it was about collective consciousness. So here's my post here um, that I created based on, you know, roughly what the video is about, something that I could quickly put in a Facebook group. So I said, have you heard of Philip K. Dick and his theory in the collective consciousness? I thought this was an interesting video that touched on it. What do you think? So what I did is I went to Facebook and I typed in collective consciousness and then I went down to groups and then I just joined a whole bunch of these groups that um, looked like they were all about the similar topic. Now I noticed some of them said, you know, not to post any sort of, you know, videos or links. So I didn't join the groups that were very strict on that. Um, obviously you don't want to be spammy, but like, um, so let's say, you know, I went into this one, I shared it. I said, hi, new to the group. This video inspired me to search and find other people out there thinking the same sort of things. And that's honestly, truly how I feel. So I'm not lying here. Um, and I, you know, I'm glad I found this cool group now. Now I did do one about Bigfoot, which I never would have thought I would join a Bigfoot group, but hey, now I'm in a bunch of Bigfoot groups. So I was honest again. I said, so I never gave Bigfoot a second thought until I saw this interview. Very interesting. Now I guess I'm here to see what you guys have to say. And then I put the link. Now you can choose to put the link in the actual post. Usually when I post, like let's say on my regular wall, I put, um, let's see that time. I, okay, so this time I put just the actual photo that I used as the thumbnail. And then I said, <laughs> this was, I'm willing to do just about anything to support my clients, including joining Bigfoot groups to promote their latest video. If the group rules allowed, of course, want to help me out and give Bigfoot a chance. It's actually kind of an interesting interview and perspective from Berkeley scientist. So I'm genuinely saying it's kind of funny. I'm doing this thing. Um, and you know, it actually is an interesting thing. And then I put the link down here in the comments because typically that's what you're going to want to do so that Facebook, um, Facebook doesn't like you putting external links in the actual post. It doesn't mind it as much if it's in the comments. Um, so there's a couple different ways, you know, you can go about actually posting it, whether it's in the actual post or in the comments. But, um, so I put it, you know, on my personal wall, I put it in the groups. Um, so, you know, I joined some Buffy the Vampire <laughs> uh, Slayer fan groups and I'm not honestly a Buffy the Vampire Slayer fan. I watched a few when I was younger, but I said, hello, Buffy fans, um, fellow Buffy fans saw this and died laughing. Oh my God, can you relate? And it's just a silly little video. I don't think it's the end of the world that I said I was a Buffy fan. Like, I don't, I don't hate the show. Um, and then again here, just being honest, you know, I went into a comedy thing. I said, I'm writing some funny sketches that I could learn something from them. You know, here's what I got out of this video. So this is going to be much easier if you're promoting your own videos and you truly um, do believe in the thing that you're, you know, not that I don't believe in these things, but that if it's all art related, it's all whatever your topic is, it's going to be a little bit easier to do these posts. Um, so just search for whatever the thing is. Like my next one is going to be about um, sustainable living and like l creating a green uh, community based on driving and how you plan a city and things like that. So I went and joined a bunch of green groups and that's going to be, you know, I'm preparing for the next video that's coming out by already joining the group so that I can, you know, post in there. Oh, and one more note, keep track of where you're posting things because it's going to get a little confusing the more that you do this. So write in here the group name, create a, a spreadsheet here, the group name that you're putting in, the link that actually goes to the group, and then just mark whether or not you posted it. So as I join more groups, I could put, you know, the name like X, Y, Z, and then this would be blank. But once I've been accepted to the group and I've posted, then I would make my little X. Um, the way that you get this URL is go to Facebook. So let's say this one, here's the name. You can just copy and paste that. And then up here in the URL bar, you just copy and paste that. So that will then, if you need to go back and reference, oh, did I put the post in this group? What's going on with it? You can just click on it and it will take you right to the actual group. So you're like, did I do that one yet? And you can easily check because it's gonna get a little crazy when they're all very similar. So yeah, that's basically all I do to, to find some other people that might be interested 
Um, let's see, like I might type in green, go down to groups. I, I joined this green product forum. They might be interested in it. Eco-friendly, sustainable, ethical, and going green. Um, uh, some of these are not so much, you know, like you just actually have to look through and is that group truly about the thing that your video is going to be about? Are those people truly going to be interested in what you're teaching in it? You know, you don't want to just spam everybody, but if they really might truly be interested in the video, why not share it with them? So it's about, you know, sharing the thing, but being as ethical as you can. And, you know, I, I'm going to try to actually be a part of the groups that interest me more. And if it's, if it's for your own channel, obviously you're going to be more interested in the topic. Um, so that is a quick little tip on doing some organic posting in Facebook groups in order to get them to your videos. I've already gotten uh, 20 or 30 different views <clears throat> just on this quick little, you know, sharing it around. I'm sure that they'll, they'll grow over the next couple hours. Hope this helped.